Uh, dear students, I hope everyone is doing great. It's a difficult time for all of us and uh, unfortunately, none of us ever hope that one day uh, we will uh, move from classroom learning to online learning. I understand that this is something new for all of us and I also know that uh, new form of learning will not be that easy, uh, but hopefully we will make it work. As a teacher, I'll try my level best to make this uh, transition as smooth uh, as uh, possible. In this short video, I'll uh, share with you some details of the upcoming online lectures. So what I'll do, I'll uh, share the course outline uh, on the CMS, I'll upload it. And then all the assignments that I'll give you during the online lectures, uh, mainly they will be best uh, at the uh, chapter and uh, exercises. And I'll upload all those uh, assignments in uh, CMS and uh, I will also collect them through a CMS. So please, once you do the assignments, uh, upload them on uh, CMS. After we complete uh, chapter number six, I'll give you uh, a project. Uh, in that project, actually, you will be required to analyze the financial statements uh, of a company, which is uh, registered on, a Kar on Karachi Stock Exchange. Uh, this exercise, in fact, this project will give you hands-on experience of uh, utilizing uh, the skills that you learned in uh, chapter number six. The project report will be uploaded uh, on CMS. And uh, once you complete the report, uh, you will be required to upload uh, your report on CMS. Once I receive uh, the report uh, through CMS, I'll uh, scan it through uh, Turnitin just to make sure that you came up with the original uh, responses. Uh, the course material, mainly uh, the YouTube uh, recorded videos. I'll upload uh, the links on CMS and I will also upload the PowerPoint uh, slides on uh, CMS. For delivery and engagement, uh, we will be interacting with each other in uh, two different ways. One is uh, asynchronous, which is like the offline mode. Um, in that mode, I'll upload uh, three recorded lectures uh, each week, and I'll uh, provide the links uh, to you through CMS. And for synchronous, uh, which is the live interaction, each week uh, we will interact with each other uh, through uh, Microsoft uh, Teams. Uh, the interaction will be for one hour and uh, participation will be absolutely mandatory. Uh, this is important because, of course, once you watch those uh, videos, I'm sure you will have uh, some questions. So this platform will give you an opportunity to ask me questions. Uh, and at the same time, uh, you will get an opportunity to uh, share your ideas with your uh, other uh, class uh, fellows. Um, of course, we have a WhatsApp group. So let's say if you would like to ask any questions on that group, you are most welcome uh, to do that. Uh, you have my email, which is uh, mazulla at uh, gk.edu.pk. So if you have any questions um, that you would like to email it to me, uh, of course, I'll uh, uh, go to my email on a daily basis and then I can uh, respond to you through my email as well. Uh, as far as uh, the assessments uh, are concerned, um, as I told you in my first lecture, uh, quizzes will account for 10% of uh, the course grade, assignments 10%, class participation is 10%, project will be 15%, midterm 20%, and the final exam is uh, 35%. Uh, assignments, project, will go as usual for the quizzes and final exam. Let's do not worry about that uh, because we are still working on the assessment uh, methods uh, uh, for those uh, two items. Technologies in the course delivery, actually, um, as I said, I'll upload uh, the recorded lectures uh, on YouTube and then I'll share uh, those links with you through uh, CMS. Um, then Microsoft Teams, 
probably this is something new for you. So what I'll do, I'll uh, share this link um, on CMS. It's a collection of nine short uh, videos. Actually, they are made by uh, Microsoft Teams. So they are very, very short and to the point uh, videos. So highly recommended. Please go through that and then you should be able to learn uh, some nitty gritties uh, of the Microsoft uh, Teams. Of course, we'll be using uh, WhatsApp. Uh, we have a dedicated uh, WhatsApp group for the purpose. And uh, for course uh, material, and uh, ask, uh, let's say, if you have any questions, of course, we have CMS uh, and email. Learning, so how will you learn about uh, different topics? Number one, you will learn by watching videos, of course. I'll try to make those videos as elaborate as uh, possible. I'll give you multiple examples. Uh, but of course, let's say if you do not uh, get any uh, concept or any idea, or let's say if you think that you need more clarification, you are most welcome to ask me questions on uh, Microsoft Team, WhatsApp, email. I'll upload uh, my PowerPoint slides uh, on, the CM on CMS. Uh, so please uh, go through those uh, PowerPoint slides. Uh, of course, they provide you an indication of what will be covered uh, in the chapters. Uh, but in order to grab uh, all the concepts, of course, you have to read uh, the recommended uh, book. Um, another way you can learn, of course, if you interact with me, uh, you can interact with me for, for any questions, any clarifications. And uh, the other group that you may learn from is your class fellows, your peers. Uh, of course, if you have some ideas, please share with the, uh, your other colleagues on any platform, Microsoft team on WhatsApp. Uh, learning is something uh, that can be done actually from anyone. I mean, you can learn from your teacher, you can learn from your class fellows, you can learn from your parents, me as a teacher, I also learn from you all the time. Um, at the end, let me give you a quick uh, success uh, recipe. Online deliveries, unfortunately, this is something, as I said, something new. Something new for me as a teacher and something new for you as a, as a student. So you have to keep yourself very, very motivated. On-campus learning is entirely different than uh, online learning. Sometimes you feel lazy, you do not uh, watch uh, videos on time. Uh, so you have to keep yourself motivated. And of course you have to exhibit uh, exemplary discipline. So let's say if my expectation is that you have to watch the video, let's say on a certain day, within a certain time, I expect you to watch those uh, videos. And as I said, I'll spend lots of time on those videos. So I'll make them very, very carefully. Um, and I'll make them as simple as uh, I can. Uh, but please, unless and until you watch them, those videos do not mean anything. So please watch them. Um, again, if you have some questions, of course, no matter how good I try, um, there will be certain areas where uh, things are not that clear. So um, the other success recipe, if you have a question, do not keep it to yourself, ask it ask it on a common platform so that your other friends can also um, benefit from it. And as I said, we also learn from our uh, colleagues. So you learn from your class fellows. I learn from my colleagues here in the teaching faculty. Um, for example, let's say, what is the best uh, possible online uh, method uh, to teach my students? So I, I learn from my colleagues. I also encourage you to learn from your, from, from your class fellows. And learning is a continuous process. So let's make it a habit. Let's make it a part of our daily life. Uh, and then uh, exercise. Exercise, actually, I'm not talking about the chapter and uh, exercises. I am uh, talking about like physical fitness. Uh, that is something really, really important uh, for you in this age. So uh, since you are restricted most of the time to your house, so please, please take uh, good uh, exercise. Get some fit on your back and I'm sure the whole learning process uh, will be uh, fun for you. I hope uh, that we will have uh, wonderful uh, interactive sessions. 
And uh, as I said, if you need any clarification, any questions, anything, I'm just one email away. Uh, drop a question, maybe one or two lines uh, on a WhatsApp group, and I'll be happy to uh, respond to those uh, questions. Thank you very much, and I hope you enjoy the online learning uh, experience. Thank you.